and welcome back guys gvids here if you guys are new here make sure you do subscribe to the channel and that way you never miss out on any future video streams or anything fun like that and we did get a pretty nice little update for gta online um, and alongside of that also is a new gta plus event or pay to win event whatever you want to call it um, so i'm just going to quickly go over the few little things that we got today to see if it's worth it for you obviously if you're a really old player most likely not really worth it for you to pay um, it's about seven dollars a month and you get uh, a little bit of money five hundred thousand dollars a month plus some free stuff some bonuses uh, just to make the game a little bit easier so if you are new to the game it's actually very very helpful for you uh, see there's just some of the cars that they've added from the update here we're obviously going to go for this free one there, and we're going to go and customize it after we get it delivered. Um, also, we're, we do get the free garage from the CEO office, um, which is actually one of the best looking garages within the game, at least in my opinion. Um, so luckily, I actually got that for free today as well, since that was one thing I didn't actually buy. Since I've had multiple other garages, I just never really had the use for it. Um, but since it is free, I will definitely take it and move some of my fancier cars there for sure um, let's might as well do that now I think it's this one here yeah so we're gonna go ahead and grab this garage which is worth uh, 1.5 million doll hairs not too shabby for free I suppose well it's not free we do pay monthly for it um, like I was saying though it makes sure it's worth it for you if you do decide to a uh, uh, sign up for the subscription just uh, don't throw your money at something that you may not feel is worth it for yourself um, I'm just going to quickly pick a few little things here before I buy them as well since I'm in here. And uh, I'm not getting it for free since I chose some other stuff, but that's alright. There we are. I'll eventually do some uh, car switching today, or probably later today at least. Anywho, let's go ahead and I'm going to go and quickly customize that car that we got here. Um, this is it here. Absolutely gorgeous looking car. It's just a sports car, so it's not like crazy fast or nothing. Um, let's go and find out what kind of customization availabilities they have for this thing. Uh, I do know with the tuner cars, you have a ton of uh, selection to choose from. This one had an okay amount of stuff. Um, nothing too crazy or anything out of the ordinary. Um, just I blasted through this since obviously I'm very indecisive and I go through things multiple times um, So I'm not gonna make you guys do that with me So we will speed this up and get to the end there. I'm choosing hot pink I've been choosing some other colors other than black lately and I've been doing some purples and hot pinks I don't know why but uh, it looks snazzy on the car with some white rims And I was trying to find the rims that I actually put on most of my cars for some odd reason which is the concave mesh uh, it takes me a little bit to find that there at the end there we go that's what I was looking for I don't know why but I really like those rims especially on any car that semi looks like a supercar I tend to put those on there no certain reason just personal opinion of course that's all there is when it comes to customization it's purely uh, you know personal choice of course but anyways guys that's all we have for today I hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys did make sure you do share like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one